Greetings to you, friends. I wish to talk about the dialectics of managing people who are though friends, but not members of one's relationship. We are talking about the act of managing friends who are outside the scope of a person's relationship. And you know it's very difficult to manage this situation where you are in a relationship with somebody and you still have many friends. This is because the human being does not jump from birth into a relationship. A relationship happens as a result of a long journey and it has to do with choice making. One, having passed through the school and having gone through a neighborhood and also even religious affinities, the person has been connected to people. And so settling on somebody is actually primarily the choice of the partner in a relationship. And this being the case, it means that the person who has made the choice to settling on a particular person has got to be committed to making the choice work. It demands maturity actually, because when once one has made this choice, one has got to define the quality of the relationship one has got to be committed to it. And so in all ramifications, the person who has made this choice has got to ensure that people who are not members of this relationship are given their place. They are told where and where not to cross. The boundaries, the relational boundaries have got to be defined. When this is the case, people can enjoy their relationship and build it to the finest edifice they actually desire. For those who get easily jealous or apprehensive when someone in a relationship is greeting or talking to people out there, let it be, let it be called to mind that friends are also very important in any relationship. But as I said, Abinicio, Maturity demands that the person in a relationship be very committed. You build your relationship first before you start thinking of what friends can contribute to your relationship. And if there is a good understanding between the partners in a relationship, you can accommodate friends. But first, the relationship you have is like the mainstream. It's like the essence of your everyday doings. Then, others are like accidental tributaries, but the mainstream is your partner, with whom you have to establish something cogent and something admirable. Thank you.